What's up everyone? This is Jens. Let's unwind with Biomutant. So uh, I'd say we get right into it and we're going to take over the Lotus Fortress. And after that, uh, well, whatever the name of the last tribe is, we'll just crush them. That's what's happening. All right, what does our Sifu have to say? They've been waiting for you. Taking control of this fort will bring peace between your tribes. Um, I think we don't really care about the defense, so you we're better ready. Be. A tribe's fort is a bigger challenge than an outpost. If you say so. They've positioned a storm tower near the fort that you'll use to get over the wall. However, you need to prop up its wheelhouse first to stabilize the situation. Okay. If you say They've so. Build the storm tower to protect and get you over the walls of the fortification while keeping an element of surprise. Okay, off to the stone tower then. Ooh, someone is angry. I wonder. Oh. If they will help us get to level 30. Pow, pow, pow. And here are more of them. <laughs> and now this one yep that was that oh that was pretty damn we didn't look we didn't even look at the stats okay There's another level up. I'd say we definitely take uh, a look at our little furry friend. Four level points of it. Right. I'd say we definitely Reflexed. kick up our strength a little. And the rest we put about it. in luck and... Uh, Stay with the high crits. Now, side powers. I'm. I was. I was definitely looking forward to unlocking that the Kai Spark. Um. We damage all of them at the same time, kind of. If I understand correctly, we'll see. We're just gonna put it on X and see what happens how that works and here we have a mud punch oh that's cool use a melee attack to follow up with an air strike attack on a target that's knocked up. 
Okay. Sounds interesting. Um, right, and there's the turtle form. Yeah, well, going by the little side video, we're not, not all too often in a situation like that. So um, let's just try the mud punch. Currently not using those all too often anyway, so all right. And that'll be A, and apparently we just uh, um, unequipped the Kai Spark. So that goes back on X. Huh? Now what's on B? I don't even know. Mm -hmm. I think we're just gonna uh, get the moth mouth back because that was actually quite helpful. All right. And maybe try and remember to use some of them every once in a while. Okay, so we find the wing house. Okay, gotta give it to Toxum. They built these to last. Another bank shelter. Apparently, there's a bunch of loot around here. And always sad to see a ruined shopperia like that. There's a shopperia right next to it. Great. The cranks need to be unturned in the right order. Hello, safe box. Chain blade. That is an add-on. Wow, that looks rad. And 28 to 47 damage. That's that is that is quite nice actually. That is lovely. A noozle. There's one more super blue supposed to be happen to be hidden in the shop area. See if we can find it. That is after we took care of those guys. Now, ooh, oh, that was it already. I see. Okay. It's not it. Car. Ah, it is in the car. Bygone pants. But those are not helping us. Anyhow, off to the bank shelter. Hmm. Hi. Mystic Nitro. That's an interesting looking magazine. It adds serious accuracy and a bit of armor piece actually. And the reload speed is like 100%. Wow, that is serious. Cool. That is a very neat looking handle and it actually has really good stats. 
I'm afraid we're gonna have to look at our equipment again shortly. How about we take over the remaining two tribes and then we check out our equipment. I think that that sounds fair. Run that. Yeah, I was considering calling the horsey, but I think with getting through the water and everything, we can actually just run those 200 meters. There we are. Let's see what our Sifu has to say now. It's time to set the rival tribe free. Inflict as little damage as possible as you make your way through to their Sifu. The same as everything. So. Convincing the Sifu that peace between your tribe. Okay. Get out of the way, guys. I do not want to hurt you. I repeat, I do not want to hurt you. You're really leaving me any choice there. What? Okay, are they are they gone? Oh there's one. And he's gone too. Okay. The tree of life still stands. Question is, for how long? So this is where the bladesmith usually would have a setup, clearly. And there's some sort of indicator back there in the background. I wonder if we can... Ah, that's the... that's the... Um, fast travel spot. Alright. fire starter. The dry grass looks like it would ignite easily. You just need to create a spark to light a fire. It burns brighter than there the There we light. go. All of it set ablaze. And wave number two. Okay. 
at least that one hit. Okay, cool. <laughs> okay. Go make the most of the day. The battering bonker looks like a great way to get through the gate. Bet you just need to knock and it'll open up. That's bonkers. It'd be nice if I just had to knock, but uh Okay, and one more. There. The Lotus tribe is seeking to build a perfect order, regardless of how many are hurt in the process. They want to subdue the tribes, as control is the only way they can guarantee peace. He didn't expect it would go down this way. It'll be hard to talk your way out of a fight. Barbary. There's no way he'll surrender to threats. Barbary. He recognizes the strength of a good argument and agrees good it's for, for the you, best. Buddy. He'll surrender the fort to you. The right. You are free. He'll leave. Thinks it's a good gesture to want to support as well. others when you can see it. And with that, you're side by side they'll stand until all... He wants you to focus. These are the new rival outposts your tribe needs to take control of. There we go. He says you'll regret not being on their side. The only way you'll learn their secrets, Wong Fu and the tribe weapon now, is if you defeat him. And that will never happen. That will never happen. Your Sifu is pleased. Heard that You're one step closer to uniting the tribes. It's a pity you needed to use force to get the point across. But he's still concerned about the fate of the world. Anyway, no worries. He says you've... You know better than anyone. Does he really have to say the same thing after every single board we've taken over? Alright. And he still hasn't given me his hat. And not the nice one anyway. I should... Punch him in the face is what I should do. It's the Lotus Shuriken. Or smack him with the Shuriken. <laughs> yeah. The future is in your hands, so take care of it. Okay. Ooh. Wow. Okay, those are not bad. Very nice, but again, no elemental damage. So, yep, good to have them. Um, there we go, that looks like a safe exit. Okay, the Mirage again. And he disappears again. It's really like he doesn't like us anymore now that we know all the automaton can do. Oh. Too bad, really. Let's see if we can get closer to those forts. Uh-huh. 
next to this pipe plant seems to be the closest uh, travel point we have. So we're gonna take that and um, take over one or two more of their forts. Just right quick. <laughs> and um, within the next, well, this one and the next episode, uh, let's end the tribe wars. All right, this one is closest, so cannot call the gnome here. Of course, why? Why could I? Why should I? Ah, hi. Okay. Now the spike plant was the cold zone. Find us a sunset to ride into. But it's not that big, so I think we should be able to just ride through it without the need to um, change our tire. Ooh, we can fly here. Was nice. There's a little bit of a green ATM. Give me that exactly. Uh, there we go. Like they don't learn. They need to fight. There we go. What? That was it? Enjoy it over there, 750 meters. So behind that mountain, apparently. Uh, what do we find here? Some sort of grip with a half star. There was gonna be a fight here. It kind of looked like it already. Wow, they are fast. They dodge like all the special attacks. This time it hit. Nice. Okay, and now... Now we punch them into the ground. What?
Right. So now we have the Super Wong Fu state fully active and there are no more enemies. Great. What's here? Wait, I didn't even check our level. One sec, where are we here? Um, doesn't say. Ah, level 31. There we go. Okay. In that case, we have a new headgear. The mipped head. Wow. Look like a serious samurai now. Cool. And uh, for the back, we also have something nice. Where is it? Um, I thought we did get it. Ah, there it is the Pichu backpack. With a little less armor, but. An upgrade in Luke Chance. Okay, cool, we'll take that. Anything else? Uh, we can quickly take a look at our perks. Mercenary. Um. Let's actually get this one. Although so far it really seems like in the jungle, the mighty jungle. The enemies are not actually scaling, so Well, we'll see what happens. Take out the big guy and pow. What? You don't want to die? Let me convince you otherwise. Good. Discovered no. Fanaki leaves, the densest jungle in the land. Better get hacking. Fanaki leaves. Take the wrong route the underfoot here. outpost, right where the Pichu tribe dug it up. Also, another very elemental question. Is it still worth it to look into these little dugouts? Okay. There we go. There's the tyrant who runs this outpost. 
He didn't expect his tribe to lose as they're the ones that keep out, you know, but you got it at the job. He just realized a piece. The outpost belongs to your tribe now. Okay, one. He of says three. you made them weaker, but they won't give up. Wow. Your Sifu thanks you. Your he tribe is growing stronger. One mean face, though. He says you did a great job capturing the app. What? Says your Alright. Um, yeah, I'm just kind of like skipping through my Sifu's words now because quite honestly he doesn't really have anything new to bring to the table so she does that um, the shops are open let's take a look shall we says the shop holds something for everyone especially you um that's not that's not better anyway looking here first nope shoulder pads definitely no upgrade available backpacks neither torso yeah okay How about is it the pew pew token? No, that's that's the uh, bladesmith. Wants you to take your time. Let's see what you got. Oh wow! Absolutely nothing. That's a first. Peddler is eager. Sit. Mm. Okay, well, that, that was highly disappointing. There's absolutely nothing in this fort that would be of interest. Um, 560 and 900 meters, I think we can definitely still do that one. If we're about it quickly. That that old home still relatively together. Mm. Something is hidden here. Let's see. Oh, you need to give the attention a matching adjustment. There we go. Hello, twink twink. That sounds delicious. You're full of pluck. Good. We did get that one. And there in the distance we can already see the tower. There's yet another scrap totem. Kapow. You found the Moly Hole outpost, an old Pichu tribe hole in the wall. Okay. And 
apparently we need to go around the corner to meet up with our contact. <laughs> Serious undercover operation here. There we go. What? Who are you? And where are you? There you are. Exactly. In flames is right. What? There. We just turtle strike him. And there he goes. Says they've been waiting for you to help. Yeah. The scout spotted a well. Same as always. The well poisoning and bombarding and other really questionable behavior so far. I'm not entirely sure we are the good guys anymore. But that when doesn't it rains, make us it gets wet. the good guys by default, does it? Get in there and ruin that. All thing. right, that goes like just a nope. few moves left. Make them count. So and over there is the next one. Usually with a fight. There we go, and we punch him. Good. Just a few moves goes left. all the way around. And, oh, ooh. Sorry about that, I was a bit too quick there. Um, oh, <laughs> okay. Sure. That was that. There we go. Up and around. 
left. Make them count. Got it. Nothing but greasy goo in their pipes now. Looks like the outpost found out about the bad water the hard way. The outpost belongs to your tribe now. As it should. He says you made them weaker, but they won't give up. Your Sifu thanks you. Your tribe is growing stronger. He says you did a great job, Captain. Yellow, well, I think it says you're in. Yep, yep. All right, out of here. And off to the last fort. It's so dark out. And then we can take over the fortress. Says the gates will remain open. There we go. All right, let's motor. the village named Lobley Dirk. Did I know? Woohoo! We can fly! Ooh, wow! Stuck the landing on this ladder. Wasn't even aiming for it. Well, okay, quite honestly, if I if I had been aiming for it, probably I wouldn't have stuck the landing. So there's that. Um, this is let's so quickly about this spot. make it daytime. There we go. It's another river. Ooh, that's a uh, uh, pet food bush. Huh. I don't know if that worked. I mean, it didn't say anything. Um, great. So you can either find the. Uh, the mounts or you can find the pit food bush but never both of them good to know <gasps> there are some now where did we leave that great wasn't it over here Ooh. It worked actually. It worked. We can now ride an elk. Cool. That there is a fume foundry where toxinol processed go juice. A fume foundry. Right. Party Bulba Plod. Okay. Um, you know, buddy, I don't really have time for you right now, I'm afraid. Um, also, I lost my bearings. Thank you very much. Over there is where we're going. Uh, 
Now I just need to get out of here again. Yeah, I think the cutscene and everything, we might just die in it. No, we're not. Okay, good. Good, good, good. And over there is where we need to go now. again. Ah, now it did. Ow. Ow. Heal. Okay. And we made sure to heal, so Everything now let's quickly get out of here while well, we're still alive. Radioactive zone warning. Woohoo! Shoo, radioactive zone. Shoo. Okay. We're good. We're good. We made it. Just like in real life, don't stay in radiation too long or, you know, it'll seriously hurt you. That's a bang cloud, where Toxanol used to make all sorts of splody things before it blew up in their faces. It made splody things? Well, in that case, now we're just gonna have to look at it fine here because I'm still waiting for a bomb. Oh, okay. A boom bong! <laughs> Ooh, a radioactive gun. A radioactive gun with blast powder. Okay, that could be cool. That could be cool indeed. Um, is there something inside this building? No. Well, there might be, but there is no way in, so. Or is there? Ah! Almost. Okay, I'm. I'm fairly sure I can get up here. Ah! Yes! I can. Okay, now. Where's the roof entry? There's none. Great. Okay. Dude, what are you? Are you shooting at lasers? Wow. He seems to not be liking us. You know what? We don't like him either. So there's that. Sorry, bud. Was it? Okay, and over to the last 
part of the Pichu. The end is coming to the world and everything else. Whoa. Plan to fall down there, so. But there we go. Oh! Uh. Come on, guys. I do not have time for you. Gonna have to bonk you. Ooh. Cool move. Okay. Gonna have to try that again, but now first for this fort. It's the Benerf outpost, right where the Pichu tribe dug it up. Says it's time to set the outpost free. Inflict as little damage as possible as you make your way through to the rival captain. If you can, you should try to convince the captain to give up. Um. I will. Here's the first up. line no. of defense. Careful of that pew pew. Let's now. try that again. Oh, that didn't sit. Ooh. Okay, that is actually quite, quite nice. Hey. We can just punch them into the air without having to... Without having to uh, first counter. Also, thanks for the help, dudes. Like he was just standing there. You could have actually Better to put it down. done something. No more bullets from that. But that is a, a serious issue in pretty much any game. Um, the the guys who are in your party. Usually, absolutely pointless. It's time to no, find okay. a way out of this place. No, really, I mean it. You already said that. There. Just a few moves left. Make them count. And there we go. Keep going. I want to see what that is, so. 
kind of have to go there. Heads up for that oil boiler. Uh -huh. That again. Stay away till you take that thing out. It's safe to get near you. There we go. Pow! That hit hard. And that hit hard as well. Here's the second line of defense. Well, if you insist, I will fight you too. You've been warned. that um ah right this prophet right okay just jump on that candle and get it right that sprocket this is quite cute though I like that Almost there. There we are. The outpost belongs to your tribe now. Exactly. He says you made them weaker, but they won't give up. Your Sifu thanks you. Your tribe is growing stronger. There we go. And now we just need to take over the you fortress. Did a great job capturing the rival's third out. Says it will... Which is up next. Gonna quickly travel there. Meet up with uh, our troops. Who are probably already waiting there. The air is so vibrant. Wow, I did find my way out of this fort quite quickly. That is rather unusual. Usually, even exiting the fort would kind of lead to some sort of confusion and uh, general getting lostness. <laughs> Um, all right. There's my elk. My little elky elk. Let's ride. Could be a monster napping here at any time of day. Really? You know what? That uh, seems like a refreshing idea. Ooh, what's that? The elk is mean to us? Well, there, elk. You should not be mean to people. Now, where is the fluffy hulk? Huh. It doesn't show it on the map.
usually they are kind of shown on the map as well so I thought maybe we could just have a little bit of fun with the fluffy elf but apparently that's not happening um the gooing of the water in the ground is spreading. Now it doesn't even show the tooltip anymore. Nope. That's that's where I Part the the mean elk, right? Like right, right there. Okay, let's go that way again. Um. Yeah, no. All of this area is the Fluff Hulk nest, but there now it shows me. There should be a Key Swallower monster, a green ATM, one superb loot and one secret loot vault. The vault could be over here, but however, usually the Fluff Hulk would be somehow on the map. And it's not so. I don't know. Maybe some other thing where we need to like get some weird side quest first or something. I don't know. It's a bit. Um. Not very. Um. How do you say? Uh. Transparent. It's a bit intransparent. There you go. Um, and it's somehow also. Oh, come on. There we go. It's somehow turning into a kind of general feeling of not exactly knowing. Um, what's going on somewhere or no um. <laughs> ah, come on one of those again really yeah, this is this is exactly what I'm talking about. You just don't know what's happening or what they what the game wants from you or um at some points even why you are doing something. Like here is this little Okay, I, I mean, I pressed Y. Yeah, okay, clearly this thing does not want to talk to us. Um, right, also apparently we can get up there. Let's check this out. Um, yeah, those Little things want to apparently be caught or should be caught, but we cannot. And there is no explanation as to like why. Do I need to upgrade that net kind of thing or do I first need to activate some sort of weird side quest or what's happening 
we do not know. Um, and we cannot guess either. So. A brick rack that's still standing. Now, that's a find. And that has uh, sadly um, turned into um, a recurring theme throughout the whole. The cranks need to be unturned in the right order. Just a few moves left. Make them count. Which is uh, quite sad, I have to say. Um... I did definitely get into the game with a no time for yawning. Day is calling. A serious promise to give it a fair chance and see what all what all the the bad and good comments are about. But Bang Shelter 11G. Too bad these aren't proof against the end of the world. See there, <laughs> just yet another another place within the place, literally, kind of. Um. Yeah. So um, ultimately, it is uh, too much. Just it's just too much. Biohazard rest. Okay, cool. Um, where did we come in here? Here. Good. Okay. Another side character, uh, or rather important NPC, apparently. Um, oh, get out! Because clearly, Probably there haven't a been a lot of things buried out here. Enough of those yet. Um, but yeah, this is Burble Bottom, residence of Gil. I would say that is rather a good time to finish this episode, right? even a fast travel spot here. That's good. Let's see. Okay. Um yeah the the second superb loot in the in the big house is just another like you know find it or don't we don't know. Um, this appears to be Gil, and we will be talking to him in the next episode, and we will also annihilate the Pichu tribe, and uh, hopefully end the tribe wars. So, please leave some feedback in the comments, 
don't forget to subscribe and as always thanks for watching